If you hold up your right hand with your palm facing you and you say that's the state of Michigan, then somewhere along your pinky would be Wineshki. All along that left side of your hand is the Gulf. Got one, I shout, fish on, and after maneuvering it close enough, my dad reaches over the gunwale. We needed quiet, so we sat in the hollowed out trunks of silver maples or behind tangled curtains of black raspberries. Whose From the Ojibwe, Michigami, or Great Lake, so redundantly, Lake Great Lake. The Notable Books Program is uh, an annual uh, of, uh, program where the Library of Michigan highlights uh, 20 of the most notable books that have been published uh, within the past year. And since the library has become involved, we've been uh, really proactive in trying to uh, promote Michigan writing, Michigan reading, uh, Michigan authors. This is my Michigan. It's the part that I feel a passion for, and everybody, someone else writing about the very same place would write something slightly different. This is where I came to myself as a writer and as a teacher, and so place has everything to do with the way in which I identify myself. The books that, are, that you find here on this list really cover the, the full spectrum of, of writing um, and research, and so there's always the you know, automotive history books, um, there's books on Detroit, um, books on local histories and local community histories, um, and then also fiction, books that are set here in the state of Michigan. Uh, literature, before it was a written and read thing, it was a spoken and said thing and a heard thing. And, uh, you know, the Bardic tradition was not about bringing books, but about bringing authors. Of the 20 authors that were selected for this year's list, um, I believe it's uh, 14 of the authors are going to be participating in, in a statewide tour. To put readers and writers in the same space, I think, is a useful thing, because you hear words in the writer's voice. Where else but in our public library can we indulge our curiosities, imagination dancing in the round as one notion changes? I think our state really has a great story to tell. It is absolutely necessary that libraries, teachers, parents, and young people find ways to connect uh, readers and books and authors and make reading exciting again. Produced by Michigan Television in partnership with the Michigan Council for Arts and Cultural Affairs and the Michigan Humanities Council.